Father, forgive us for what we must do. You forgive us, we'll forgive you. We'll forgive each other till we both turn blue. Then we'll whistle and go fishing in heaven. Fish and whistle, whistle and fish. Eat everything that they put on your dish. And when we get through, we'll make a big wish that we'll never have to do this Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with another episode of the Fisherman Fishing Planet. Haven't been doing this quite as much recently because I've had a lot of reviews I've been doing, and I'm kind of ha at a loss with basically for ideas of what to do here. I was getting a lot of stuff to do based on suggestions from you guys, but I'll be perfectly honest. I mean, I've advanced to Sander Baggersy. I'm That's not my my favorite lake to be honest it's just not uh, there's a lot about it I don't care for but I was trying to touch on as many things as I could there wasn't sparking a whole lot of interest with you guys on that I did come back here to Blue Crab Island and the reason I have done this is twofold one I haven't been here for a while in this particular version and two I am there in Fishing Planet Classic and like I've said over the past there's been a lot of overlap but I'm starting to see some things become a little bit different and right here is one of those spots uh, I've got I'm pretty sure I had ca uh, caught a unique permit here now just to make sure that that is the case I'm gonna check to see what all I have caught that way I'm not lying to you guys and I might who knows you know I have not caught a largemouth bass here but I know where to get them I have not caught a unique I really have not oh my god maybe I just knew where they were okay I'm sorry I did not mean to do that guys I was sure that I had here so let's go ahead and close this down I always have trouble with that okay we are going to go into private room ooh it's raining <laughs> alright now we've got this boat here and believe me I like this boat so much better I wish I had this boat in Fishing Planet Classic I wish I could pick it up and take it with me there because it's just the right size for getting around all these little bayous back here and it has rod holders and 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 you control <laughs> that's the biggest thing I wish you could troll in Fishing Planet Classic it won't let you do it dang it but anyway it looks like I still have a carp rod I don't need a carp rod in this thing at least not yet um I think what I'm going to do is take a look at the map here. Now, I have markers all over this thing, as you can see. And what we're going to do is see what are at these markers. See? Permit. Unique permit. This must have been given to me by somebody. And they had you caught him off a of buzz bait with an X-Series Glow Crawl. And I think that's one you have to win by completing a mission. Now, I don't know if that makes a difference or not, but right here you can see they can be caught there and they can be uniques. There's another one. So there's two caught there. That is a good spot for this game. Let's see, that's Black Drum. I think there's another unique permit somewhere. Let's see, Tarpon, Striped Bass, Snook. Flounder permit. Yep, right over here at this spot. Now that's a spot I've been using. So what do we got here? We, we just got markers. I don't know what was. Ooh, I caught a permit there. That one I did catch off of large minnows. That's interesting because it doesn't say they go for them. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what, guys. Since we've We could try to see if we can't catch them here. It's worth a shot. And I am going to try the large minnows since I can do so. So, let's see how different these two games are. 
Now we are not in the peak. Not even close to being in the peak. Can we do know that we have to be lined up with that? Okay, now the rod holders are in the back. Oh wow. So we need to back into this a little bit. Actually, whoa. Let me get this adjusted and I'll be right back, guys. Alright, guys, I'm back. I've got lined up. See, my rod holders are right there. So I kind of wanted them lined up. This is the spot that they were supposedly caught at. And I was fishing towards that direction. So I might have gotten that mixed up. But then again, this is a different version of the game. So we are going to see what happens. I did have some of my viewers were very nice to have loaned me those spots. But again, like I said, they may have nerfed things down on the original one. So knowing this about these stick ups, I thought it was those over there. And maybe, maybe this will make a difference. Let's just let's just see. Now what we're gonna do, we can fast forward time. Wait a minute. We can't bring that up. We need to get to about 7 p.m. Alright, so time. There we go. And let's see, what do we got on our gear here? Okay, these are... Okay, one of these is a carp rod, so we're not going to be using that here probably at all. I don't think there's... Is there any carp here? I don't think there are. I can check. I don't think carp are found here. So that rod's kind of like a... Yep. Yeah, don't even need it. Might be able to use it for... I don't know. I don't think so. It may not work. Anyway, guys. Let's close that out. Now in here, we're going to get some bigger hooks. Obviously, that's not going to function very well. Let's go with 4 aught. Let's see what kind of test do we have. 42. That should... That should... Do alright. It's gonna be a little it's gonna be a little bit of a test here. We're gonna try the large minnows. On this one, I'm going to try shiners. I tried everything else. Let's go a little bit bigger. And shiners. Shrimps too many things go for the shrimps. We were trying to focus on that now. Now let's see here. We've got the Brutus Rod, which goes to 35. The River River Tech Zeus, which goes to 42, and the Sharp Caster. Now, how much distance can we get out of this? Because this is uh, this would be the ideal one to fish with. And we've got well, the Titanium Leader still only goes to 41 pounds. That's probably due to my level, honestly. So let's go ahead and use the Zeus because the Zeus is more maneuverable. Um, let's put an X-Series jig head on here. Supposedly you can combine these, so we're going to see if that's the case. Now uh, here's the buzz bait that they used. Oh, okay, there we go. I'm sorry, I don't need the hook. That's the buzz bait they used, and then they combined it. Well, they combined it with a different jellyfish. I don't think I have access to that deli jellyfish. But these are supposed to be really good. These twin tail spider grubs for the permit. So we'll start with that, and we could always try this jelly crayfish as well. I 
And what we can do is cast these out right where these guys are supposed to be. Now we may get quite a few other things. Now I like this version of the game, but there are pros and cons to this, just like there are with Fishing Planet Classic. I wish they could merge the best of the two. That's what I wish they could do. <laughs> merge the best of the two. That would be that would be ideal. But it is what it is. Damn. Holy crap. Okay. There we go. We're going to start this off interesting from the very beginning. And it's a permit. See what I mean, guys? They're here. They are here. At least in this version of it, they're here. Also getting a lot more money for them here, too. So now it's just a matter of catching... The, uni the unique version. I mean, I had no sooner thrown it in there, and they went for that. I'm going to have to try that in part two. I'm just going to have to. Alright, let's see if they go for this. I'm going to cast it out as far as I can. That almost hits the shore. Damn. This is a good rod. It's a really good rod. Okay. Damn. Very nice. Right off the bat. And this is no slouch of a fish. Okay, we've got us a decent fish here. Trophy common snook. Well, we knew that was going to happen. Well, I'll tell you, they really are biting over here. And this is another good one. Got to remember, too, my gear here is nowhere near as high as it is on Fishing Planet Classic, but so it's going to be a little more of a struggle to pull them in here, but... That's another permit, guys. Damn. 1332. Now I really have to go back to... I really have to go to back to Fishing Planet Classic. Now that I've found the spot, the right spot, I think, anyway, and if it doesn't catch these permit guys, we're going to know they darn nerfed it down. This, this and Fishing Planet Classic used to be identical. Used to be identical where you could catch them at Blue Crab Island, without a doubt. So they could have nerfed things down for Fishing Planet Classic so that they could... I don't know, make more money? Who knows? Let's see. Oh, I think we got us a tarpon. We might have us a tarpon. I'm pretty sure of it. Ooh, yeah, we got us a tarpon. Check it out. Whoa. He is running. Oh boy, that's not good. He needs to slow down. <laughs> he needs to slow down just a bit. We only have 300 feet of line. Yeah, another big reason I wanted to come here is I'm seriously low in cash here. I don't have the 
we can't get the Congo and Maroon Lake and all those others, Maku Maku Lake, where you can really make some serious cash. This is pretty much the biggest cash location. So if you want to be able to grind, you need to purchase the DLC, which is not much. And you can grind and grind and grind. You'll get enough gear to be able to make it work, so. Damn, this is, well, it's a tarpon. See, what I should have done is lifted the anchor, but I could still do that. I just have to put the rod down, which is always risky. I'm going to let him think he's got, got control here. Okay, we're gaining a little bit of ground, but he's getting it back again. Oh, he's really getting it back again. Shoot. See, the thing is, since I've got this position, I really don't want to lose it. Yeah, with tarpon, this could just be a regular tarpon. This doesn't even necessarily have to be a unique or a trophy. They're fighters. They are seriously big fighters. I need to get enough cash to upgrade this equipment a lot better than it is. Well, guys, this may take a while. <laughs> Okay, we might have him this time. Hold on, there he is. Here he is. Yeah, it is a tarpon, and it's a tro. It's a personal record tarpon. Very nice. 440, 44.16, and that was great timing because I would have sucked to have lost this one too. I think this is a red run, yeah. Red run! <laughs> okay. You can see already the difference in the catch rate here guys I don't know if you I fished here in the same type of day and I was catching them but not like this so they have nerfed some things down that is undeniable somebody wants to make a little more money Just saying. <laughs> Just saying. See, if I hook another fish, that right in it, that that in and of itself will tell you something. Okay, so nothing went for it. Let me try over here where I thought was the spot. <coughs> Something is messing with that one, yeah, I was going to say. Oh, if it's another tarpon, I'm going to be here a minute. I think it is, but it's not a, a trophy. Let's see, come on. Yeah. Still, look at the cash. It's almost double what it is on Fishing Planet Classic. But see, I really need the cash badly. 
badly, badly need a cash for this game. Shoot, now I'm going to have to recast that again. <laughs> I was hoping... really want to see what you get because in this game when you get a unique you get bait coins really want to see how many bait coins you get for a unique tarpon and for a unique permit yeah I knew there was something farting around with that one It's a black drum. Yep, 1324. Good money, good money. Okay, what is. Let's try right at this marker. They're very close together, so. Honestly, these rod holders location is a lot easier to work with, too, in my opinion. I'm going to try something here, guys. It seems like that's re being reeled in very fast. Let's try it at one. I'll be damned. I honestly did think it was a little bit on the fast side. Okay, common snook. Let's try that again. I don't know if twitching this makes any difference or not, but you can do it. It worked real well with the uh, snake heads during the um, St. Patrick's Day event. Damn! That's two hits right off the bat, and now we've got another one over there. Well, let's see here, guys. I think we got this one in all right. This is a trophy bonefish. And I think this is a common size of whatever. Red drum. No, it's a trophy red drum. Very nice. 1858. I think something else is biting on that one, too. Let me check something here, real quick, guys. What is the biggest line they have here? I've got a rod that can handle it, but oh, it's not looking like I can get anything bigger than 44 pounds. Damn it. Yep. And in my inventory, I have 41 pounds. I'm limited to that, guys, I'm afraid. So I can't go... 
can't get the most out of my stronger rod, unfortunately. Not until I level up a little bit. Okay, I think this is a permit. Yep, see that fin? The name permit, if I'm not mistaken, has something to do with scythes or something like that. Scythe fin or whatever. Which is what their fins look like. I'll have to look that up to confirm that, but... Okay, this may be a trophy. I don't think it's a unique, but it is definitely bigger than the last couple we got. Holy crap, and he is really a fighter. Oh, damn. There we go, we got him. No! He's regular size. 1364, just a daggone good fighter. And here we go. Yeah, I'm not sure my gear could pull one of those uniques in. I don't know. I think the only way I might, I'd probably be able to do it if I would take the anchor up. There's another one. 15 pounder. Well, they're definitely here, guys. At least in this version of the game, they're definitely here. The permit are abundant in this spot. Now, like I said, I have got to try this in the classic version. And if I don't catch them like this, yeah, they've done something. So we're going to prove something here, guys. We are going to prove something. Have the devs nerfed the game? <laughs> we shall see. We shall see. Dum dum dum. Okay. Yeah, I have a tendency to make these go a little bit long, and I do apologize for that, but I get so into this, and I just want to catch another fish, and another fish, and another fish. And I know you guys who like to watch me feel much in the same way, and I do this in real life, too. I'll go fishing, and I'm like, I'm going to go fishing for so many hours. I find myself there so much longer, because I might just catch that fish this time. <laughs> Okay, that time I didn't get anything. Let's try this again. We should be in the best part of it. The peak, I mean. Come on, fish. I'm going to try twitching this time. Ho ho! I don't know if that made a difference, but it definitely caught me a fish. Let's see here. What have we got? I think it is a permit. No? It's a unique bonefish. Unique bonefish. Awesome. Awesome. This is a 16 bait coin catch here, guys. 
16 Bitcoin catch. We are going to look at this guy. Very nice. Oh man, that's great. That is awesome. Let's get in the sun here a little bit so we can get a better picture. He is a nice fish. There we go. Sixteen bait coins. Alright, that is great. I'm going to try the twitching again. Well, the idea is it looks like a struggling fish. Damn! Well, I tell you what, that technique definitely works here. And it seems like the bonefish really go for it. <laughs> okay, the trick is though, what about something else? Well, other species go for it, like tarpon or permit. See, it's cool to learn new stuff, especially when you discover it by accident. So I doubt we're going to do as well for pyramid at night. We might catch some other things, but right now that twitching is really working well. But if it's a bonefish, it may be just that's what they go for. It's the bone the bonefish like that. That's what it is. I, I The only way to prove it is to catch another fish, and so far that's the only thing I've been catching. I've been the bonefish off that technique, but, you know, I'm not complaining. I mean, they're decent cash, easy to get in. You don't have to fight them so hard. And I even got some bait coins out of it. Okay, now we're talking. This, I don't think, is a bonefish. If it is, it's a big one. It's a snook. Level 44, guys. We've gone up. What have we got available to us now here? Technoplankton. Perfect. That means we can get the big mouth buffalo, and I've been wanting to be able to get them here. That's what they bite best on. Let's see what we got here, guys. I think it's another permit. Looks like one. Nope, it's a tarpon. Common tarpon. 1674. And I've got one on this one. Damn. Man, I wish I had half this luck on the Fishing Planet Classic. I tell you, this is this is great. Yeah, fishing by classic on all the other lakes, I've had no issues with. Like I said, it seems like I haven't been catching nearly what I should for this. Alright, let's try that rod again. I'm 
determined to get this darn unique permit. I was really happy about that bonefish. That was great. Though the fact that we've been getting the permit here definitely shows that they are here. It's a partly cloudy day. Might do better on a sunny day. Something has been biting on that. See? It just didn't get it. Let's try up in the speed a little bit and just doing a straight. We're almost to the end of the night, so this is the biggest part of the day peak. Yeah, there we go. It is night. Now what's the Okay, we are in a peak, so we can still do a little... Well, let's go ahead and get this last fish, but we're going to have to probably call the episode here, guys. Because it's been a little long. But it's been fun. And we were able to prove a few things. Ah! Trophy Gaff Top Sail Catfish. Very nice. He's very nice. Well, guys, I really enjoyed this episode. You, I got to level up. I was able to prove a few things, at least to myself. Discovered that this is not the spot. Sorry about that for Fishing Planet Classic, guys. This is the spot, at least it seems to be. The only way to know that for certain and whether, about, whether it's been nerfed down or not is to go try it on Fishing Planet Classic. But anyway, guys, as I always say, aim straight, cast far, and have fun. And I will see you later. Bye-bye.